All right, uh, Chilla. I know you got you got something uh, hanging out on your wrist, and it's not what I think people are, think it's going to be. No, in this world where everybody's getting their Apple Watch or cursing the fact they have to wait three months for their Apple Watch, you walk into my studio with the Motorola 360. Well, <laughs> Moto 360. I have one on too. So, and oh, brothers. Nice. <laughs> So I, I I will actually say yesterday I got an update on my Apple Watch order. Apple updated my status of my order. I will get my it, I ordered between the third and fourth hour of, of online ordering, and I am May twenty eighth through June eleventh. So I'm in like wave four or five of of the Apple Watch orders. Um, but that being said, I got the I picked up the Motorola 360 because it was on or Moto 360 because it was on sale. Um, it gets a lot of good reviews in a lot of the podcasts and stuff that I listen to. Um, I will I will say it's it's the screen is great. Um, the one thing that that really bummed me out was in looking at um, a lot of the apps that are coming to to the Apple Watch. There is not much to choose from in the good old Google Play Store. Really? Like, there's, uh, you get all, it, it, actually, what the funny part is, is, it's like this to me right now is like a nice screened pebble. All my notifications come over. Yeah, I can do a couple things. Like, I can get my steps from the Moto Body app and Moto Calorie Counter app and this and this and that. The other thing is that I'm waiting for the new update to come out which is supposed to hit in the next week or two, because the interface seems a little not always spot on. I could not disagree with your statements more. <laughs> now, you've had some more time on this, right? So Yeah, I've had yeah. it for, what, about three, three or four months? Yeah. Um, at least, I, I guess since Christmas. I've had it since Christmas. So uh, I'm an Android fanboy anyway. Like, mm, I'm, okay all in with android i root my phones as soon as i buy them um <laughs> like uh, uh you i don't want to know anything about the apple watch i haven't even read an article um that's it's ridiculous of me I so, so what apps it. are you using that kind of give you control over the app or allow you to respond with more than a dismiss or um or hangouts open, has open a up keyboard feature are you updated to lollipop on your watch at least updated the lollipop on my watch i'm at like, 504 well then yeah yeah you're running the lollipop version of android where um you should be able to type back with uh hangouts you can't really do anything with like twitter or anything like that what were you hoping to do on your watch so that's that's what i was actually looking to do is like for if, if someone tweeted something with a link i could add it to pocket or i could um Favorite something. Favorite retweet something retweet, like that. Retweet yeah, like okay. those types of things. I was I was looking for not just a prompt that because one of the things that's interesting that that works really well on this that didn't work on Pebble is the ability to, to dismiss the notification mm -hmm. back on the phone, which mm -hmm. I really like. Play your cards, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, the now cards are nice because I use now cards for my commute to and from work. Right. Um, I use Google Now for everything. I love it. The, the interesting thing too is um, I'm hoping for more because they announced today. I think they have now have 70 apps that they're interfacing with um, the now cards. Okay. But it, I, I guess like I, I have used it to, to kind of pull off the remind me this set a timer schedule thing something. Watch does. Yeah. But I, I guess I was looking for more interaction with the app notifications. There's a little, yeah, more interaction. I agree with you. Yeah, I would definitely use that. It, like retweet especially. Yeah. Because anytime someone mentions you, you at least favorite it, right? Right. That's that. That's kind of like, it was even on the Pebble, I'm, I'm kind of like, man, I wish I had that little functionality because that's what I miss from the Google Glass because I could, something could pop could up, pop. I could tap it and retweet and or, and, or, and or favorite it. And Did you have one? I, uh, yes. Oh, well, actually, uh, I, I have now, now he has it. So. Which Twitter drops support for it. So now <laughs> I would have no use for it at right. this point. So it was that useless. Yeah. Well, it, well, just, it, I, I actually, I mean, for, for me and what I get a lot out of it. I, so yeah. I have a 13 month old at home and he like capturing his first steps and his birthday, like all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's phenomenal. I will say the battery life 
horrible. Is horrible. Horrible. But and and as a as I wear glasses naturally, and I'm not a huge fan of contacts, I actually um, will wear contacts. With